live from KTVN Reno, you're watching T News at 5. Michael Schneider and Leilani Tau Schneider own Puppies Plus in Reno and Puppy Love in Sparks. I'm Kristen Remington. I'm Ryan Canada. Thanks for being with us tonight. They're both accused of practicing veterinary medicine without a license. Tau Schneider is also charged with torturing and or killing an animal. Paul Nelson joins us now live in the newsroom with the latest. So, Paul, what happened over at today's arraignment? Well, Leilani Tauschneider pleaded not guilty to the animal torture charge, Ryan, but the couple did not enter a plea for the other five counts. The judge entered a not guilty plea for them. That's because the attorneys filed a motion to throw the case out. Their position is they have done nothing wrong. They've not done nothing wrong by statute. They've done nothing wrong by regulation. Uh, they shouldn't be prosecuted, period. The Washoe County District Attorney's Office says it's confident in its case against the Schneiders, but the defense says the pet store owners did not break the law by giving medications and treatments to their puppies. They say they and their employees are exempt because they own the puppies and got the medications from a licensed veterinarian. They also say Tau Schneider did not torture or kill an animal, but actually tried to care for a sick Cocker Spaniel puppy before it died. That charge would require proof of malice or intent. Their lawyers say the case is based on hearsay from a former employee and that the Schneiders are being targeted because some people are against puppy stores. They could say no more pet stores. California, no pet stores. Las Vegas, no pet stores. Here, it's a legal occupation. So what they're doing is, uh, you know, they're attacking the pet store owners instead of the idea of should there be pet stores. The city of Reno is holding a meeting tomorrow night. It'll be at City Hall starting at 6 p.m. According to the agenda, council members will discuss a moratorium on new pet stores in Reno. The mayor wants to discuss the issues and challenges of so-called puppy mills, as well as talk about what the city can do, what they can and cannot do about them. Covering Crime Beat live in the newsroom, Paul Nelson, 2 News.